everyone, it's Bailey, Jessica, and Sheree from the One Oak Real Estate Group. In this video, we're going to determine our favorite dynamite roll in Prince George. A dynamite roll is a type of sushi roll that typically contains tempura, avocado, cucumber, and spicy mayo, if you order it spicy, all wrapped in a layer of seaweed, nori, and sticky rice. The roll is then typically sliced into bite-sized pieces and served with soy sauce and pickled ginger. Dynamite rolls are a popular menu item at many sushi restaurants, and they are known for their crispy and creamy texture as well as the spicy flavor. Now let's try some. Let's start. First off, we have Earl's. Now the nice thing about Earl's is that they actually come with two different sauces. So you can have it spicy or not spicy. Wait, or else they make it really fancy once you're there. <laughs> the other thing I like about Earl's is if we compare them to the sizes of this, you can fit it in your mouth. In one bite, you're not <laughs> making a mess. Size. <laughs> yeah. And that's what I like, especially if you're on a date or something. <laughs> Lunch meeting, you don't want to have sushi everywhere. True. I don't know, does Cullen mind? But Sheree, can you imagine being on a date and having sushi coming from everywhere? No. <laughs> okay. One of the things I love about the Earl's Roll, personally, is a little bit of mango that mm -hmm. they put in there. Me it's, too. It's a nice twist on it. Mm. So, yeah. I think I actually mm -hmm. taste the mango in mine. It's just like, oh. right there. That's oh, mango. Interesting. Yeah. I think I put too much of the spicy sauce on. So that's <laughs> all I taste. <laughs> but texture-wise, it was good. Definitely fresh. Mm -hmm. um, next, fresh. we have Sushi Yori. Um, Those are big there. bites. These are much bigger bites. <laughs> so I'd say the different thing so far from the Earl's one is we do have um, the imitation crab in here and we don't have the mango of course because that was the extra special thing. They're also almost double the size <laughs> of the Earl's one. So you gotta try to get this all in your mouth in one go and chew <laughs> on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Chess, what did you think? They were a lot crunchier. It was a lot crunchier, mm -hmm. wasn't it? Yeah. I like that. And it was it was really warm. Like the rice yeah. was warm and everything had a everything had a good flavor to it. Yeah, I thought that was really good. Plus you got a little bit because the roll is bigger, you get more avocado, so I got a little bit more of that creaminess to it. Yes. I love avocado, so I think I preferred that one. Um, but I got the end piece. <laughs> so you got the giant piece. <laughs> so that was hard to maneuver in my mouth. <laughs> the end piece is always. <laughs> I saved those for Colin. Yeah. yeah. Not a wise choice to have that one on camera. Okay, what's our next one? Next we have Mr. Sushi. Do you want me to take the MP? <laughs> yeah, you take the MP. It actually doesn't look as big as yours did. So the difference I already see in this one is we have cucumber. And it's a bigger piece of cucumber, so it's like half the amount of avocado has been split with cucumber. Mm -hmm. This one also has the imitation. Sweeter yes. rice, much sweeter. No. I actually preferred the first one because to me that's just a little too sweet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like yeah. I don't want the sweet with the creamy with the fish. I can see why people really like it though. Yeah. Like, it is good. It was. Well, I had the end piece. That was easier. <laughs> too. <laughs> I mean, it's still really good. Yeah. It just is yeah. definitely a little bit different of a rice combination. It mm -hmm. is. Yeah. Okay, and our last one. Jess. I'm taking the middle. These are big end pieces. <laughs> and this one is from Sushi97. <clears throat> this one has lots of little tempura bits, lots of cucumbers, lots of some cucumber. lettuce, uh, drizzled with some mayo on top. So the one thing we're not seeing is the imitation crab. Mm -hmm. Yes. So that's the biggest yeah. change here. Now, not everyone likes the little bits of tempura. I'm not, I usually, when I order it, I say no crunchy bits. 
because I feel like I don't get as much good stuff. I get the crunchy <laughs> bits for filling. But they do provide crunch. Yeah, they do. Okay. That was fresh. Mm hmm Really refreshing taste. Um, I don't know, I think the lettuce added a lot there, which is surprising because not like lettuce adds a lot to most things, but it was a very crisp and fresh taste. Mm -hmm. And I also think the lettuce and the crunchy bit just made it super crunchy, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Like it was a good yeah. play on textures in there. Yeah, I actually really like how fresh it was. Yeah. So the big question is, what is everybody's favorite? Mine is between the Sushi um, 97 and the Yori Sushi. I think both of them were amazing. Um, I am a little bit biased because I love Sushi 97. I love everything that they make. I would to order this one again too. And Jess? I think I actually like the Sushi Yori one. Um, probably the best other than Earl's. I love the mango and the Earl's one. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know, classic. <laughs> And I'm gonna go with Sushi 97 because I actually am not an imitation crowd person. I prefer to have, you know, that little bit more of crunchiness added into it. So, but they're all fantastic. You can't go wrong with you any of them. So no, very good. So we'd like to know, what is your favorite? What have you tried? Let us know in the comments what your favorite sushi restaurant is. And what do you eat it with? Are you a soy sauce and wasabi <laughs> or are you just straight up? the way it's made. If you like our content, make sure to subscribe down below so that you don't miss any of our content. And give us a like while you're there too. 